Welcome home. The Orthodox Church is evangelical, but not Protestant. It is Orthodox, but not Jewish. It is Catholic, but not Roman. It isn't non-denominational, it is pre-denominational. It has believed, taught, persevered, defended, and died for the faith of the Apostles since the day of Pentecost 2,000 years ago. Driving along Heinz Boulevard recently, you may have noticed a small building with a big cross hanging for all to see. The building is relatively new, as it is the congregation of faithful believers coming together in worship, but the Holy Orthodox faith is certainly nothing new. The Orthodox Church traces its direct lineage to Christ himself, passed down through the Holy Apostles to the faithful clergy and laity from generation to generation, always unchanged, completely unaltered. It is not a mere religion of this world, but a transformative, eternal experience lived through grace. To truly understand Orthodox Christianity, one must experience it. For many years, the Christian world was, for the most part, one united entity in communion with one another, with major regions overseen by five hierarchs. The five centers were Rome, Constantinople, Alexandria, Jerusalem, and Antioch. In the year 1054, after years of theological, political, social, and linguistic difference, the Western and Eastern churches split in what is known as the Great Schism, thus leaving Western Rome alone, while the four Eastern regions remained in communion with one another as one church, holding true to the early councils and decisions of the one united Orthodox Church. It is for this reason that the term Orthodox is used a Greek word meaning true and proper glory. Eventually, Rome would contend with subsequent reformations and theological inventions, but it was the Holy Orthodox Church that continued, remaining unchanged. From generation to generation, guided by the grace of the Holy Spirit and through apostolic succession, the Orthodox Church continued to flourish despite severe persecution and hostile environments. Fast forward another millennium to Cheyenne, and we find a small parish called Holy Apostles Orthodox Christian Church of Cheyenne, which is a direct continuation of this same church, maintaining the fullness of the Christian faith. Currently, we hold our worship services in a hall located in the community center. As we continue to grow, we plan on building a proper Byzantine-style Orthodox church structure where we will worship. The Orthodox Church utilizes all the senses during worship, the beautiful hymnology and iconography, the use of incense and receiving of the sacraments. The primary focus, of course, is being in communion with our God and with one another. We invite all to join us in worship and fellowship at 9.30 a.m. each Sunday and to visit our parish, as our beloved hierarch often says to those visiting, welcome home. Christ offers to each of us a message of salvation, a message to be transformed by entering and living and dwelling within the Orthodox Christian Church. It's a message of transformation, to be illumined by the grace of God and to live forth proclaiming his good news always 